A very good morning to you. My name is Benina Washera and welcome to the Uni Breakfast Show here at Unib TV. The Uni Breakfast Show is a show that brings to you topics that range from lifestyle to entertainment to relationships to as many as many as many topics as you can count. We bring you things that affect you on a daily basis we ensure that also as you wake up in the morning you get energized and also you get to start your day at a good note please follow us on our social media platform that is on instagram uh, unib underscore tv on facebook unib media tv and on youtube unib media tv also follow me on my social media handles that is miss washera on instagram and penina washera on facebook let's keep conversing and let's keep on talking about the things that are affecting us on a daily basis so today being a monday we are going to talk about the artistic monday where we talk about arts entertainment and media this topic of the day today is about the entertainment industry where we are talking about how it is influencing us and why it is important to us just to dive in to the topic of the day so we as human beings, we are beings that love socializing, amusement and entertainment. And it, in fact, it is said that all work without play makes Jack a dull boy. I know all of you can relate with that. So if you spend your day working and not have time for entertainment, you actually become dull. So I would like to tell you guys that it is important to also be entertained because it helps us in so many ways. When we feel entertained, our energy even becomes better, you know? Yes. So today, I, I want us to kickstart this, knowing that entertainment is there to help us, and mostly it gives us a diversion from real world. So, and the good thing about entertainment is that entertainment is everywhere nowadays. If you tune into Unib TV, for example, you get entertained. If you go to YouTube, to WhatsApp, you get entertained through memes and even videos to TikTok, Instagram, you get entertainment at its level best. So let's talk about the advantages of this entertainment industry. What makes it so good for us to feel entertained? One, it relieves stress. For example, if you're heartbroken out there and you come back, uh, maybe you're heartbroken or you're having a bad day and you just go, tune into maybe your phone gallery, your music gallery, sorry, and also go to you, YouTube and maybe search for music that really makes you motivated. You listen to it and you play it on loud, uh, uh, you play it loud on your phone. It makes you relieve the stress. It makes you feel even better. When you even go to comedy, uh, maybe to the YouTube and watch a comedy or two, you end up laughing your heart out because you feel like there's something you, some tension you want to release. So you feel so entertained. And that really helps you relieve the stress you have. Another thing that entertainment brings to us, it is employment. Like Kitambo, if you will go to your parents, when do you mama to me and a DJ? Mama kwa alikuwa anakuambia uko show yeye itakuletea pesa ama itakuletea chakula kwa meza because they never thought that entertainment can really pay. If you go and tell maybe your parents some some of our parents are very traditional and if you go to them and tell them mom me want to be a vlogger they will be like yeye nakuletea pesa aje inakuletea pesa how will it make money for you? But in real sense nowadays in the 21st century we are really making good money from the entertainment industry. If you check on our YouTube, vloggers are really making good money. Filmmakers, actors, actresses are making good money from the vlog vlogging and also from acting and filming, which nowadays is a very good source of en uh, entertainment and also a very so a very good source of um, a very good source of employment. If we check also on musicians, musicians are actually making it good out there and they're making good money. And the good thing about uh, the entertainment scene, you are able to do something that you love with your whole passion, something you're passionate about and also make money. Is that not good? It is, right? Another thing is um, the entertainment scene helps us to nurture our culture. For example, if you're a Luo, a Luya, a Kikuyu, and you go to your to social media scenes or maybe specifically to YouTube and check on what really happens uh, on these specific events during uh, in a certain culture. For example, if I check on the marriage in the Maasai culture, 
you get to learn so much about the culture and when you're learning all these things it helps you nurture more about your culture and makes you even feel like you belong to that specific culture because now most people are not uh, are not being educated about the culture like it is so hard to find mostly the youth talking in their mother tongue unless they are interested in doing so but say can you tapata watu wengi ni kuongea tu sheng wanajinize tu hapo nje so we have forgotten our culture and another way of entertainment has brought is a better way of helping us to nurture our culture is it that nice it is right another way that the entertainment industry has brought us good is the fact that it is helping us to nurture our talents and also our passion if i want to know how to cook i will definitely just go and search for the best way i can be the best cook around and then start cooking when i'm at home also at the comfort of my own home i can be able to learn how to act or do something that i am interested in and this is really helping us to nurture our talent As much as we are talking about the positive things, we can also not forget about the negative things. So many things have brought us negative when it comes to the media industry or the entertainment scenes for uh, to be specific. One thing is low self-esteem. Uh, we have seen so many people uh, getting low self esteem simply because of what they see in the internet mostly on instagram utaona mtu ameingia instagram anaona rafiki zake walisoma na yeye and they are really making it good out there and they are like okay mimi kweli nimekuwa nikifanya nini uh, and at the end of the day unakuja kujiuliza maswali maybe you see she is now a model and maybe it was once ulikuwa unafikiria kwa model pia wewe and now because of maybe what is happening in life you cannot maybe because you you when you were small you were petite but now when life has continued ama vile umeendelea you get yourself as a plus size so it doesn't mean that you cannot be a, a model but the fact that you cannot be as the other person so guys it's not it's it's very good to have the the uh, entertainment scenes but let's not focus on the negative mostly let's not look at people and feel like we really really have to be like them let's be ourselves when it comes to that so that we cannot have a lot of low self esteem going around another thing that uh, has brought us no good is crime if for example i watch a movie for example the money hist movie There are scenes for example they are going to maybe steal uh, from the banks money from the banks now you ukiwa tu hapo nje una feel eh yenyewe pia mimi sina pesa naweza jaribu pia kutafuta hesti yangu mimi mwenyewe alafu nianze kuiba so because you are seeing this movies you seeing that many people are also making money mostly on films unaona pia kuna money laundry unasema pia mimi naweza jaribu which is not good no you will indulge in crime and at the end of the day uta end up committee sorry to say so instead of seeing these things and then wanting to to become like that why can't you uh, see that these people are acting ujaribu kukuwa actor at least hapo umeanza kujaribu kutafuta ka passion kiasi you're trying to act you're trying to be an actress so let's such for positive things when it comes to the entertainment scene tusiangalie sana vitu zenye hazitusaidii maisha ni you know another thing that uh, is really really uh, affecting so many people is pornography many people will really really look at what we are not supposed to like tukiwa wadogo tumeshinda tukiambiwa don't do this don't do this lakini we find ourselves doing it most times utapata you literally looking at Uh, whatever you're told not to do if your parent tells you not to do this ndo unapatanga unafanya so at the end of the day you are told um, do not watch pornographic movies do not enter into pornographic sites uko ndo unakimbia because simply because most youths tunataka tu kukuanga wale wa mbona ananiambia we are very curious beings so we tend to uh have uh, asking to ask ourselves we tend to ask ourselves uh, why should i not do this why are they saying no, for me not to do this so unajipata you curious and you go and start thinking about it so when you're thinking about mbona huyu aliniambia nisifanye hivi you get yourself uh, watching the pornographic videos so that you can get to know mbona mbona ni see what So at, at the end of the day when you start watching the pornographic videos you start indulging in sexual intercourse at a young tender age and when you do that we have now things like uh, early pregnancies teenage pregnancies happening 
unplanned for pregnancies happening and you know it is not good for you As, and that is why you get most people sasa hapa umekamta unaanza sasa kusema sasa mimi nilimess maisha yangu and it's something that we were told earlier do not do this do not do this so let's try and also listen to what we have been told tusikwe wale watu wa ati unaambiwa hivi alafu una plan acha nifanye kenye najisikia utafanya kenye unajisikia then at the end of the day utakuja ku lia peke yako Another thing that the social media scenes or the entertainment uh, industry has brought is cyberbullying. Like so many people are going through uh, depression simply because of cyberbullying. Cyberbullying is uh, bullying through the internet. Najua sisi wenye tuko mtaa tumezoea anga ile bullying ya tukiwa high school. Umezoea ukisikia we just unajuanga bullying ukisikia bullying unajuanga tu ile bullying ya high school vile ulikuwa unaambiwa ati eh we unioshe hingo kama unioshe mimi nitakufanyia hivi but there is now this type of bullying that is cyber bullying where many people are really really getting depressed due to the way they are being bullied on the internet it is something that is not good imagine having a friend who is going through cyber bullying amekuwa uh, amekuwa depressed simply because of being bullied in the internet it is not good and guys let's just consider ourselves imagine your sister ako just imagine that your sister or your brother is the one going through this so don't be a person who una bully wenzako it's not good and it's it's actually not good anyway so those are some of the effects that we've, we've been talking about uh, on the entertainment industry i hope you've learned something or two a thing or two from the conversation we've just had right now and if you're somewhere or if you're someone out there mwenye umeenda through these negative things ama pia mwenye una enjoy the positive things just continue commenting tell us what you're really enjoying about the entertainment industry When we will be going for a short commercial break when we come back I'll be joined by a panel who will be telling us more about this topic of the day. Remember the topic of the day today is about the entertainment industry and how it is influencing us and why is it important to us. Don't touch that dial. We'll be right back. <laughs> 